how happy are you with your performance? Uh, I cannot describe how happy I am. Uh, it's been a long road and I've heard it's going to be easy to get to the UFC, to, get, uh, to just be here, but my road has been up and down and finally I'm here and I got my first week. Were well, you surprised you didn't finish him in the first round? Yeah, I mean, I remember I dropped it. I could hear the sound of my knee hitting his chin and like, he, I thought, I think he, he fell straight down. And I don't know, I punched him and then he, he went back to life and I tried to finish him, but I cut a lot of weight, so I was really conservative with my energy. So when I felt like I couldn't finish him, I went, I laid back and uh, my coaches told me, okay, this is going to be a, th a three round fight. Then I tried to um, f fight with more I higher IQ and just yeah, fight really smart and conserve my energy. Now, with the higher IQ, we kind of saw you open up with your hands a little bit more, especially you open up with your knees. We also saw a lot of good uh, improved takedown defense from you. Um, was this a case of the defense enforcing the offense and the offense enforcing the defense for you? Yeah, I mean, I, I let him do mistake and I kept a lot of his mistakes. I, I didn't try to force anything. I let him do what he, I know he was coming swing, and I let him do that in the first couple of minutes in the round, and then I took over because. Because a lot, he used a lot of energy when he comes with those looping shots, and he did it. He missed, and then I capitalized on that. Uh, we also saw some uh, some interesting boxing defense bits of fade. You were doing kind of the the uh, filling shell shoulder roll kind of deal. Yeah, Can you talk about that. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm I'm very um, I'm very confident in, in my uh, uh, boxing uh, boxing defense, and I let him punch me, and I, I just tried to roll with it. And when I saw an opening, I attacked him, and. I tried to put in a show, and he, he, he's, he's that kind of fighter too, he wants to put in a show. He told me for the fight, let's do fight the night, and I, I just did what I love, and that, that's fighting a, a good fight. Were you surprised you got up after you hit him with the knee? Yeah, I, in my head, I was seeing 50k. In my head, I was like, oh my god, I'm going to get the bonus, uh, the, the knockout bonus. And when I couldn't finish him, I was like, okay, uh, that uh, uh, time B, so yeah. And you continue to be aggressive even late in the third round. Was that? Did you think that you might not be winning the fight, or is that just the kind of guy you are? That's who I am. Like, yeah, I, I try to fight smart, and I try to not like uh, hit the wall with the gas, and because I cut a lot of weight for this fight. I got, they called me on uh, Saturday night, and I was around 157 pounds, so that was like 23 pounds over. So uh, I knew I, I need to be smart with my. Uh, how I fight because otherwise I'll eat the wall and it would be a lot hard night for me. You were 23 pounds over last Saturday? Yeah. How'd you get down? I, I just do, do it, you know. I, I mean, there's a special, there's a couple of techniques I'll have to lose weight, but I can tell you I, I was struggling and uh, I, I hit the wall uh, when it was one pound left and I told my coach I don't want to do this anymore, but they told me this is UFC, you need, you need to make weight and they, they, they pushed me, but I can tell you I, I, it was a hard time. I fought. I'm, I'm so happy that I am um, recovered and fight, fought as well because it, it was really, really hard for me to win. In the second round, it seemed like he was trying to draw you in, smiling at you, waving at you. Uh, how did that affect your mindset? And Nothing. I was focused. I, I was just focused on what I'm going to do, the techniques I've been working on, and I was just focused. I tried to tell myself, do this and do that. Don't focus on him. Just, just go in and work. Did you have that 50K spent? Huh? Did you have that 50 grand spent? If I will have it spent, yeah. I mean, if I get it, <laughs> if I get it, I hope. Are you picturing it spent? I don't know. I mean, honestly, I, I, I just hope I, I, I get the bonus. I think it was a good fight. I, I, I don't know. I, people told me it was a good fight, and I mean, that, that's a big accomplishment for me if I have put in a good show. Losing, losing all that weight. What are you going to do now? Are you going to put back some of that weight that you did lose and, and I mean, get back I, up to I, that? Honestly, I think I already put it on. <laughs> Yeah, it was a lot of water. I lost a lot of water. I mean, normally I'm leaner than this, and I, it, the, the workout's a little bit easier. But um, yeah, now now I'm going to get. I, I live normally in Sweden. I haven't been uh, home for like six months. So now I, when I get the, the money from the UFC, I'm going to go home and see my family. I haven't seen them for a long time. Do you plan on having a relatively quick turnaround? What do you say? Do you plan on having a relatively quick turnaround to have another fight soon? Of course, I mean, I'm gonna see my family for two, three weeks and then I'm back to work. Now when I sign with the UFC, that's a job. I have a job now, that's how I see it. Thank you, everyone. Thank you.